Hey guys, it's Lyra here. Welcome back to another theory video. And in this video, I'm going to be going over a lot of new changes and mysteries within patch 4.4 and going over some theories for you guys. So the way I'm going to organize this video is that I'm going to tell you guys about the story so far of season four, a lot of changes that are going to be significant for the future of season four and what could potentially happen by the end of season four and what my theory personally. So as we already know, there's movies being made and the superheroes that we know are actually actors. Well, they could, they might not be actors, but it's pretty likely they're actors. So it's they're not going to do anything. So I think that's a wrap. Uh, I don't think they're going to be involved in the story anymore. And basically the Hot Rocks trucks have been moving on to a destination we don't know yet. I'll get on to that later. One of the big changes that happened is that the Blockbuster skin has been freed and he's escaped. He's broken out of uh, his rock. He's fighting back. He's escaping. And yeah, this he's escaped. Now also, I also want to mention uh, this right here. I mentioned in a lot of the videos. I've talked about how this could be a secret spy and he's watching the blockbuster skin i'll get onto that later because this is going to be important for my explanation so stay tuned so when i say the guy with the telescope and the chair that's what i'm referring to so uh yeah as you can see the trucks are still on their way they're currently over here and people are speculating it's going to go to the the missile now i'm going to explain why i don't think it's going to be the missile it still has a good chance of being the missile but i don't see why and i'm going to use some proof of what i know and using clues around the map to explain my theory anyway uh let's get started so I don't think it's going to come here, but there's a huge question going around saying who is the one activating the missile? Because if you go in here, uh, you can see a lot of changes. These computers have been lit up, so someone's been using them, not all of them, but it's starting to turn on. Uh, maybe these are going to turn on next week, and then maybe this is going to be fully functional by the end of the week. Functional by the end of the season, we don't know, and the, the missile's going to be launched. Because we know the missile's going to be launched, or it's going to be used in some sort of way. It wouldn't be here for no reason. That would be kind of pointless for them to put this in the game aesthetically so yeah we already know that something's gonna happen someone's gonna blow up we don't know just yet but we just know something's happening so like i said the computers are turning on there's been some small changes here a big change here is that i didn't notice and someone let me know in my last video which i'm really i'm happy for this is a perfect example of when i miss something in my videos you guys can comment it down and i can correct myself but there's meteor rocks here now uh there's more than just this there's a lot if i go up here somewhere there should be they're discovering them, they're analyzing it. Now, what is most likely going to happen is that the hop rocks, we don't know who the hop rocks are here, we just see meteor rocks. Maybe there's hop rocks here, actually. Uh, there probably is, but I just probably can't see it in this view. But yeah, the hop rocks are being uh, probably going to be used for the meteor to power it up to be later launched. One change that's happened is that we can actually go through this. Before, we couldn't do that because it was just solid. And we couldn't go through it, but now we can, including this. Uh, we can look through this. The giant X here, which uh, I don't know what has to do with anything, but maybe it's important. But I'm pretty sure someone's launching this with the Hop Rocks. Probably from uh, this site right here, because it's right beside it. And none of the other locations have come in here. But well, the question is, who is launching it and what are they doing with it? Now, possibly it could be the FBI secret cars or the governments. We don't know what these are yet. Or it could be the director of the, of the movies, people are saying. 95% sure that these aren't happening. I could be wrong. Maybe it's actually just a conspiracy theory. And I'm just really dumb. I'm just thinking it out too much. But I don't think the FBI cars are clandy coming here to this location. Like, it looks like it. They're right here. But I'm pretty sure it's not coming here. And I'm going to explain why in a second. Now, like I said, there's potentially hop rocks in here. And meteor rocks. Uh, the craters from the craters. And none of the cr locations have made its destination yet. This is the farthest one to come so far. Because it was the closest. But it's still not just here just yet, and we can still see the rocks are still in the car. But when we go over here, this is the closest one, but there's no caravan here, because it's been knocked over and attacked. And the only, this is the only place they can get the rocks from, because it's right beside it. Whoever is controlling the rocket is not the same people as the FBI. They're definitely on different teams, because he attacked them, he stole them. These guys potentially might not even know this yet, because they don't know... Like, they haven't seen it, they haven't come here yet. So, uh, those guys might have been attacked and, they didn't, and ambushed, and these guys don't really know. But I don't think they're going to the missile, unless they're going to the missile and there's going to be an all-out fight at the missile. The final fight, guys, uh, Carbide vs. Omega, Dr. P. <laughs> it's finally happening 10 weeks later, the clickbait's over. But anyway, uh, as I was saying, but as I was saying, like, these cars are, might not, are probably not going to go here unless they're going to having all that war and these guys snuck in as we've seen the changes these guys like these curtains used to be open but now they're closed someone's trying to be in here secretly and maybe activate it and uh maybe those guys the government's supposed to be in here but uh their secret base has been infiltrated and they don't know until now maybe they might go in here and there might be an actual fight because they haven't gone here just yet they're almost there but they're still in here like i said actually are gonna come in here they're gonna fight it out which will be cool 
but I don't think that's the case. Like I said in my last video, I feel like it's gonna go to Haunted Hills or Junk Junction, and I'm gonna explain to you guys why. Now, there's a car in here, uh, ice cream truck blocking the way, but that doesn't really mean anything, and I'll explain that in a second. If I go to the other craters, the other craters are... They're, they're not here for they're not coming here for a while like they're behind and this crater which was decently close it should have been on its way by now but it's not it's installed and if this crater were to come to the actual missile it's going to be blocked off by this car this rv right here i'm going to show you guys in a second this orange one and if it's coming here it's going to push it out of the way or move around it so the same thing goes for the, the, the ice cream truck it's either it's coming there or it's not being in the way doesn't really mean anything now because it can drive around and also they're driving on the grass so yeah, they don't really care for the roads. They can drive on the grass if they wanted to. But why I think it's gonna be Jung Junction in particular, or Haunted Hills, is because all the craters are even, especially in the back, they're they're not coming for a while. Like they're they're on their way, yeah. But it's gonna take them a long time to get here. Maybe they're by like week nine or week ten. Then they're gonna all finally be here. Do you know how long it took the uh, the ones that tilted towers to get here? It took them three weeks to move, and it took them two weeks to like package everything like, and there's only three weeks left so we know that some of them aren't gonna make it in time or at least at least we, that's what we think unless there's a lot of patches coming in this week but there's some back there and there's not a clear route for them to actually get here so we don't know just yet but i still think it's gonna be haunted hills because if there's someone in the villain lair the hidden base uh then those guys are probably not gonna go there because there's someone else they're definitely not on the same team and they're gonna fight just yet they're gonna go to their secret base in Haunted Hills, maybe. There's like an underground base we don't know of. Whoever's in this base is not on the same side as those uh, secret cars, secret black cars. Just because they knocked this over, okay? And the person that knocked this over is most likely the one inside there. And I'm gonna explain to you guys who I think it is. One person it's not is the Blockbuster. It's gonna take a long time to get from here to there. We don't know, maybe he took a helicopter or a jet. There's like a... He took a jet here. Or he teleported, he has superpowers, like Superman speed. We don't know, but it's, it's going to take him a long time to get from here to there. And now, we already know it takes a long time for to travel the Fortnite store line, because these cars right here took... Like I said, that took a long time to get from here to Tilted. And it takes them one week to get... Or maybe, probably two, depends on the patch. It takes them every patch. So this patch, he went from Stadium to Snobby. And as you see, that's not a lot of distance. Like, it took a long time. They're, they're driving like two kilometers per hour if they're taking that long. If those cars are taking that long to get here, then the block is going to take a long time to get to the missile. He was on his way here, but I don't he think he's here just yet. I honestly believe that uh, there is someone else here. Now, someone with great strength has to knock down these trucks or this car. So it's definitely super powered. We don't know if it's a villain or a hero. Because I've made a theory that uh, these FBI cars aren't necessarily uh good guys they could be bad guys or good guys we don't know yet I'm in the comments i've been talking to you guys and I mean, i've came up with a theory that uh the people at the media right now are bad guys too and they could actually be on a different team as these fbi cars maybe it's different fbi one's good one's bad they're like secret maybe one's fake we honestly don't know yet but maybe it's like an all-out war between the two sides and like they're being compromised. If this convoy was attacked and ambushed and they've taken all the rocks, then those other ones could be easily ambushed secretly. But it's all conspiracy right now. And if those people at the meteor aren't good guys, that means that the Blockbuster skin is a good guy. We're assuming that he was a villain just because he broke out and he like he fought them and he escaped. But maybe those guys were capturing him for their own needs. And, uh, yeah, they were trying to take him in and use his superpowers to their advantage. Then he retaliated and he escaped and broke free. But that's just a theory. But the person that I think that could be in this missile is definitely the one who knocked it and he's got superpowers. But the one I think it's going to be is the one in the chair with the telescope. Like I said in the beginning of the video, I'm going to mention him. And I think he is on the same side as the blockbuster skin. He was the one watching him and he broke, he broke him free maybe. And maybe he's the one at the missile right now. It's controlling it. Maybe he's trying to get him back home. And these guys in the media are bad guys, and they're trying to kill him, you know, because he's an alien, Area 51 style. So yeah, maybe he's, maybe the missile is just to get him back home. It's a rocket, and he's trying to get his way home. Power with the hop rocks. Yeah, that could be it. Maybe he's actually a good guy. We don't know what side is good and what side is bad just yet. So it's all theory and speculation. Like I said, it's all a mystery. But we're gonna definitely gonna find out in the coming weeks what's gonna happen. Who is this secret person? We don't know. Cause there's definitely someone that we don't know about or haven't heard of just yet. Exactly. Like he's he's completely a mystery. He's eluding everything so far. We know that someone's knocked us down and stolen and hijacked all the stuff. One person or maybe it's a group of people that are a secret or mystery to us. And they're against the the. 
the secret cards, the secret FBI people. Maybe he's he's a bad person. He's trying to blow up something. We don't know yet. Maybe he's trying to blow up the hidden base that I talked about in Haunted Hills. We don't know what this meteor is for yet. It could be a bomb. It could be some sort of like... It could be just a rocket that it's just to fly up with. We don't know what's for yet. We're trying to get a glimpse of it, but like there's nothing that we can actually truly see just yet. It's because it's not powered up yet. It's starting to get powered up by the hop rocks. Yeah, but that's what I think is going to happen. Now, what I think this person is, is that it's the monster. It could be, it could be a monster because there's still a monster roaming around if all the clues are true. If you know what I'm talking about, I'm talking about the risky real sign where the signs have been changing. And first it went from saying it came from Moisty Meyer. Then it said the cabin in Wailing Woods. And then it said something about haunt the hills are haunted. So maybe there is a monster who came out of the water. We don't know. Maybe it's some sort of like Thanos-like monster. We don't know. Similar to the Thanos game mode. And yeah, this could potentially do something really cool. So maybe there's a monster here. Like I've been speculating this way before as well. I wasn't really sure then. I was just kind of making up theories. Now I the possibility of there being another person or maybe a monster with superpowers is really high. Like I might be wrong, but I... Definitely see this happening. Like, this is a good chance of this happening. Unless someone proves me wrong, I don't know. You, we can have a talk in the comments. But yeah, I think he's trying to control the rocket. Maybe he's, he's probably on the same side as the blockbuster skin because he's been watching him. He's probably the same guy who's been on the telescope with the chair. And yeah, they're trying to do some plot with the rocket. We don't know yet. Plot's still a mystery to us. Because we, like I said, we know that something's going to happen with this rocket. We just don't know exactly what. My guess is that it's probably going to fly to space. I don't think it's a bomb or anything. Unless you want to get rid of area, which they could just get rid of it completely. They could bomb anywhere they want as long as it's not like a key area like Pleasant Park. They could honestly bomb Haunted Hills. Like, they wouldn't really matter. Nothing would happen there. Like I said, this convoy is not going to the Meteor. They're on a different team. And they're going all the way there, most likely. Because if these guys are in here secretly and stealing the, the rocks, there's no need for this caravan to go here. Maybe they don't even know about this base and they're blind. They're... They're dumb CIA people. Or they have nothing They have nothing to do with it. They don't really care. It was meant for a movie because there was a movie scene in here. But maybe someone found a way to activate the rocket. And he's using it with the hop rocks to actually make it work. So that could be definitely be a plot. These guys might not be the government. These guys just might be like Area 51 people just transporting the rocks. Or they could be a corrupted version of them. Maybe there's two sides. We don't know yet. We're just going to find out in the coming weeks and find everything for sure. Uh, what I said in this video is all speculation because no one knows what's going to happen. No one knows 100% what's going to happen. If they make, if people say like it's confirmed and stuff like that, then they're making clickbait videos. But yeah, guys, uh, I think I've mentioned everything. I've had to record this again, so I don't know if I missed anything or not. If I did, I'll try to comment it down below because I've come up with some crazy theories. I've used like a lot of clues using the signs and the areas. Nothing happened with the cabin in Wailing Woods right now. It's still closed. There's nothing changed there. We're definitely going to find out what that's for later on. Maybe it's like a secret bunker for like this nuke. <laughs> and that's the only safe place that's going to be remaining. Everything's going to be changed. But yeah, that's the video, guys. Hope you guys liked it. If you did, make sure to like the video and subscribe if you're new to the channel. I think that's it. Yeah, I'll catch you guys next time. Peace. A little bit of fun with this guy. He cannot lie. Oh, man, this guy is so smooth. <laughs> he must be pooping his pants right now. Please, Fortnite gods, have mercy on me. Three, two, one. Drop it.